Welcome to part two of my look back at Die Hard Trilogy on PlayStation 1, where I'm now going to be looking at Die Hard 2, Die Harder, which in this game was a pretty cool light gun game. That was kind of fun to play, but unfortunately it was missing trophies. But thankfully I'm here to ask... So if you checked out part one, you would know that I've decided to split up the game into three separate trophy lists, one for each of the three Die Hard games. So that will mean there is three platinum trophies to earn when you play this game. But let's take a look specifically at Die Hard 2, Die Harder's trophy list. So there is one platinum trophy for you to collect, obviously. There are nine gold trophies to earn, four silver trophies to collect, and then two bronze trophies, which is the same amount as Die Hard 1, and I would give this a platinum difficulty rating of 5 out of 10. So with that out of the way, let's take a look at those two easy, shiny bronze trophies that we can earn in Die Hard 2. The first of which is the Better With Coke trophy, which requires you to destroy a Coke vending machine and take all the health pickups you can get from them. So there's quite a few of these scattered around the airport terminal in the first level, and as it's a light gun game, you're probably just going to be firing constantly, and you are encouraged to shoot pretty much everything. So it's a trophy that you'll easily get, and it's a nice little secret that you can pick up health from destroying these vending machines, and I wanted to include it as a trophy. During level 5 we'll get to earn the next bronze trophy just like Holly did and it's kind of a reference to the film when Holly attacks Dick in the toilet with a taser so if you can take out the guy in the toilet before the camera turns away you will unlock this bronze trophy for your troubles. And that is all of the bronze trophies that we can earn in Die Hard 2. So let's take a look at the silver trophies that we can pick up. So if you've ever played Die Hard 2, you'll know that it's a game where you just can't help but blow a load of shit up. You will cause a lot of damage when you're playing this game to the airport terminal and all the surrounding buildings because shit will just go down. And as a result of all the explosions, people will often be on fire. And if you shoot these people who are burning, you will trigger a mercy shot, which is basically a mercy kill putting them out of the misery. So you can earn the silver no other way trophy if you can perform 100 mercy shots in Die Hard 2. So this is one that you can get over multiple playthroughs. Next up is the Water Shot Trophy, and this is part of what the enemies can do in the game when you're fighting them, as you'll often find enemies will throw knives at you or grenades, or they'll try and shoot you with a bloody RPG, but this is where you actually get a chance to block the incoming attack, so if you can shoot the knife out of the air or the grenade or the rocket, you will blow it up or knock it away and it won't actually hurt you. And this is what's tied to the trophy. So if you can do that 50 times, you will earn the silver what a shot trophy, which I think was a pretty cool one. Next up is a low blow John, which requires you to hit a terrorist where it hurts 10 times. So this is basically performing the dick shot. When you see that that's got a hurt message, you'll notice that you're shooting them in the balls and they do a little animation. So there's a trophy for that. There's also a sort of hidden trophy in a way called Chopper Down at the start of the very first level because if you shoot down the helicopter flying overhead outside the terminal, it will give you a second Beretta so you can basically dual wield now and you can cause a lot of damage with these two pistols. So I wanted to put a trophy in for this little hidden easter egg. That is all of the silver trophies in the game. So next up is the gold trophies that we can earn in Die Hard 2. And the first of which we're talking about is the quick draw trophy, which requires you to kill 100 red target enemies without getting hit. So when a target has a red circle around them, it means they have you in their sights and they're about to attack. So if you can shoot them and kill them before they get to hit you, you will have one registered kill towards this trophy. And if you can do this 100 times, then you will unlock the, the gold quick draw trophy. It's quite an easy one to get because there are a lot of instances where this happens with near enough every enemy. And of course, you can do it over the multiple playthroughs. So if you die on level one, your progress for this trophy will still be counted, making it a fairly easy gold trophy, to, to be fair, to earn. And once you get to 100, you will unlock the gold quick draw trophy. Nice one, John. <laughs> uh. 
Okay, so next up is the gold trusty sidearm. So now we're moving into sort of the kill based trophies. And this one requires you to get 500 Beretta kills in Die Hard 2. So this can be with the single pistol or the dual wield. As soon as you get to 500, you will unlock the gold trophy for your troubles. And again, it can be done over multiple playthroughs because the chances are you'll end up accidentally picking up other weapons as you go through. Um, so next up is Ho Ho Hoed again which is another kill based trophy this time associated to all of the machine guns in the game and you just have to get 500 kills so there's a couple of different machine guns there's an AK-47 I think there's an M16 there's a Stern or something a Steer uh, so there's a couple there that you can get so if you just get a kill with any of these guns it will count towards your trophy progression and once you get 500 kills with the machine gun you will unlock the gold ho ho hoed again trophy so next up is the what a mess john trophy and this requires you to get 250 rpg or grenade kills and these are like the additional weapons that you can pick up um, not part of your actual gun so you can just fire these off at will as long as you've got ammo for them so it's a pretty cool weapon to do when you've got a lot of enemies in front of you you can clear them out with a rocket or grenade and once you do this 250 times you'll get the what a mess john trophy because seriously you're gonna make a big mess with this there's a lot of bloodshed when these bombs go off man it's crazy. So next up is the Fetch My Boomstick trophy, which is for the shotgun and getting 350 shotgun kills throughout the game. And there are two different types of shotgun that you can get, the standard shotgun and then the explosive shotgun. So these 350 kills will count whether you're using the explosive one or the normal one. So it's a fairly easy one to get as there are a lot of chances to get the shotgun. And once you get 350, you'll of course unlock the Fetch My Boomstick trophy. Next up we have a different way which requires you to venture down a bonus route, a bonus secret path while you're playing. And these usually happen if you've been playing well, so you've not killed any civilians for a while, you've killed um, the terrorists fairly accurately without wasting bullets, and you've not let any escape when they try to. So there are a few of these throughout the game, and one of the first ones is in the terminal, which rewards you with a load of bullets and health. So next up is the Just Winging It trophy, which requires you to get 200 environmental kills. So these are kills that you can do by blowing up exploding barrels nearby enemies and killing them with that explosion. Or maybe you want to be a bit more creative and you decide to shoot out some ceiling tiles and cause them to fall down onto enemies and kill them. So if you do that 200 times, you will unlock the gold winging it trophy, which I thought was a pretty cool one really. And I thought it was quite cool of the game to have that in there. So next up is the Ba Ba Bad Guy trophy, which is what you'll hear John McLean in this game say quite a lot. And this trophy is tied to the church and maybe the snowmobile chase levels in that you need to kill 50 enemies who are parachuting down before they land so you're basically causing them to go splat on the ground by shooting them out you can't actually shoot the parachutes you just have to shoot the enemy as they're falling towards the ground and if you could, which is a bit weird really isn't it you should be able to shoot out the parachute but oh well if you do that 50 times you'll then unlock the bye bye bad guy gold trophy the final gold trophy that we can earn is the They Died Harder trophy, which just requires you to complete Die Hard Trilogies, Die Hard 2, Die Harder, which is a bit of a mouthful really, isn't it? So once you get to the end level with the weird sort of plane chase where you're in a helicopter and there's a load of other helicopters and all of a sudden everyone is like standing out on the plane with wings but the plane is really high at this point and you have this really awesome but silly over the top fight it's so strange and not like the movie at all uh, but as soon as you get past that and you complete the game and you get the little ending scenes of the plane flying off and being escorted by all of the helicopters you will unlock the gold they died harder trophy and if that is the final trophy that you need in the game, well then of course you will be unlocking the Platinum Trophy shortly after, which I have called the same shit twice, which is a reference to a line in the film where he goes, how can the same shit happen to the same guy twice? Which I thought was nice and I wanted to include that. I didn't just want to call it yippee ki -yay again, uh, so I decided to call it that. Um, so that is it for the trophies for Die Hard 2. 
Let me know what you think of these trophies in the comments below and if you think you could actually have gotten the platinum for this back in the day and whether you want to take up the challenge now and go for the platinum with Die Hard Trilogy Die Hard 2. Keep your eye on the channel because Die Hard 3 is coming up real soon. Thank you very much for watching. Please, if you did enjoy this video, like, comment and subscribe. It really does help. And make sure you check out all the other videos on my channel because there's some really cool trophy based videos and just other cool gaming content. So please do check it out. Cheers.